I am Bill Mosley, and you're watching the Grim Life Collective. Cheers. Wherever I come, I've had luck. It's come to my way. Wherever I go, hard luck is there to stay. Good luck never stays a day. A bad luck's always coming my way. Hello, my name is Michael. I'm with the Grim Life Collective, and I'm here at Days of the Dead Atlanta with Bill Mosley. Hey. How you doing today? Good. Excellent. Uh, I wanted to ask you, in all of your travels, whether it's personal life or through work, maybe on set, something, do you have a most memorable travel moment? Something that has stuck out? A travel moment? Yeah, something that's like a... Yeah, the airport at, uh, in Port-au-Prince, Haiti. Uh, that's always uh, teeming with life and uh, with, a, with a very heavy flavor of desperation. And so when you get off the plane and get out of the airport, get through customs, uh, you know, you're just kind of assaulted. It's uh, very hot and humid, and uh, a lot of people are, you know, trying to grab your bags, not to steal them, but just to carry them to, to make some right. money to get to a cab. So that is certainly something. Um, yeah, you know, that's the first thing that pops in my head. How long ago was that? Was that just the personal travel? Or the personal travel, yeah, I think the last time I was in Haiti was about uh, yeah, 10, 15 years ago. Uh, my brother used to teach school in Port-au-Prince, so I would go down. I love Haiti. Uh, once you can get past the airport, <laughs> then it's great. It's a lot of fun. Uh, now it's a little light. I wouldn't really recommend traveling there right now because there's uh, there's some uh, you know controversy with their election process and so uh, tensions are high uh, politically and and uh, when tensions are high in, in Port-au-Prince, you know it's not a good time to travel. Yeah, all my traveling that I've done in the United States, visiting real life hard locations, mm -hmm. I've never been outside of the States. Right. And so many people I talk to say, you should go outside of the States. And I want to someday, so right. maybe whenever it's better there, I can Yeah, go down to Haiti, yeah, check it out. It's great. All right. Hey, part two. Part two. The long Bill Mosley interview. Um, you know what I do believe in, since I travel a lot, both to uh, conventions and to uh, to and from work. Um, you know, last year, for instance, I worked in you know the states, but I also worked in uh, Australia. I worked in England. So, um, but what I believe in, as I get rare, is what I call humane travel. Okay. And humane travel means I don't get up. You know, I don't fly at six in the morning unless I positively, absolutely have to. Um, you know, I have qualified for TSA pre. So what that means is, yeah, I mean, they've, they've checked my background and, and uh, they've given me this, this pass. I'm not a terrorist, so I get to go in a shorter line. I don't have to take off my shoes or take my laptop out of my bag. Um, so that's really good. I also have accumulated enough air miles, so I'm like in a couple of mileage programs. I've got like a gold card, so I don't pay for the first bag. And um, I also uh, get to board first. Now that is really important stuff. And you know, that adds up to what I call a humane travel. And um, it makes it a lot easier because otherwise you're schlepping, you're in long lines. And also with that, uh, you know, the TSA pre, I have something called global uh, global entry. So when I come back from any foreign country, instead of standing in a three-hour line to you know, immigrate back into the states, emigrate, um, what I do is I just flash that card at a kiosk and I put my fingerprints up and I just walk in because uh, I'm a trusted traveler. So that is really important. Humane travel. Try it. That's something right. I might have to look into. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We do a lot of traveling, yeah. but we go through the lines. Yeah, the we TSA free, man. You can't beat it. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you again. All right. <laughs> good. Have a good one. All right. See you later. They call me a calamity man. But I'm trying as hard as I can. To keep a bad luck away from me I'm doomed to win the night Filled with misery